This is Folkestone Tower. And it's time to go open exploring! Yes, let's open explore this tower! So then, this tower says Nat West on it, because pretty much the only couple that occupy it. Now they occupy the first floor, which is a bank and a couple of floors higher. All of the upper floors in this tower are all completely abandoned. There's no businesses occupying them. It's quite creepy out there. So then, along we go to the lifts, which are some mad Scott lifts, which have been horribly modernised. And let's go in this lift, put in an independent service, and let's go up to the top floor! This lift is under service control. Going up. This lift is under service control. So then, here I am, up on floor 8, and it's quite creepy up here, it's quite empty, no businesses occupy the upper floors here, so this tower is quite abandoned. And here's the spooky lift area, and along we go through these doors to the stairs, and on the left is the doors that go into the office space, which is abandoned. But the stairs carry on upwards, let's go up these stairs to see where they go, and spooky alarm thingy. Is that a spooky alarm, but if I try and open this door, it will go off. <gasps> Creepy, and this door says plant room. Let's try it. It's unlocked, and that sign thing is not an alarm, so that's good. Let's go into the plant room, turn on the lights, and epic, spooky plant room. Wow, that is really creepy. And it's actually quite quiet because a lot of these various pumps and things for doing water and air conditioning all turn on, on and off with supply and demand. And there isn't really much demand since the building's pretty empty. I mean, it is plant room. It's very creepily quiet, which is very unusual for a plant room. It is so creepy up here. Wow. <laughs> Look at all these things you've got. The various water pumps for pumping around the hot water and cold water. And there is the air conditioning big motor thingies. Very creepy. And some stairs going upwards to the roof. And over here there's some more air conditioning things. And along here we go to some steps up into a doorway, which just so happens to be above where the lifts are. This can't be the motor room, can it? it is let's go into the lift motor room and here it is and look at those old motors sadly looking a bit sort of health and safety yucky orange panels around them which is a bit disappointing but other than that nice old big motors but sadly less the controls again pretty much every motor room i've been in has less the controls so then let's open up less the controls less the controls oh crap and on the left we have the big variable frequency drive and on the right we have let's the control menu which I haven't seen before. Let's press some buttons! Yes! Button pressing time! Event log. Oh, if I went lift surfing, would this still shop at a lift went into inspection? I wonder what lift engineers think when I surf a lift which has event logging and they see it someone's been surfing it. Hmm, I wonder. Do you actually notice I have been surfing it or whether I just ignore it? Anyway, let's try some of the other things. Lift viewer. It shows where the lift is. And add calls. Let's do this. So, where shall I place a call? Let's place it on one of the floors. For and let's go. That again.
and let's go along to the stairs going up to the roof. So up I go, it's quite dark, and up to the door on the roof, and... It's padlocked shut! Oh, everything else has not been locked. Why has the door onto the roof been locked? Now I think this might have something to do with O2, since O2 have some masks on the roof here. So I think it's O2 has actually padlocked this door rather than the building owner, because the building owner doesn't really seem to care about locking anything. O2 obviously do, because they don't want people tampering with their masks. And let's go exploring the spooky plant room. And there's so much spooky stuff here. This is so creepy. Look at all of these pipes. So then coming out of the plant room, going down the stairs back in creepy abandoned office space. And can I get into the empty office floor? No, the door's locked. Ah. V key. Ugh. Going down. Please. So then, going back to the ground floor, and while I was exploring the upper floors, I got locked inside. Yeah, this is a Saturday, so this building is pretty much all shut down. Nat West, which opens just in the mornings on a Saturday, but not in the afternoons, and it's now past midday, and they've closed and shut the automatic doors. Before I find out whether I'm trapped or not, this is a good opportunity to put the lift into fire mode. Doors opening. This lift is under fire control operation. Floor one. This lift is under fire control operation. Ground floor. This lift is under fire control operation. Please mind the door. Door closed. So then, am I trapped in here? Automatic door doesn't let me out. But has anyone put a lock on the door? No, they haven't, so I can force the door open and escape! Oh. 